cubes and their interesting patterns. In this module, you will learn about cubes of numbers and some interesting patterns they form. You already know that a cube is a solid bounded by six identical squares. Also, when we multiply the length of its side three times, we get the volume of a cube. This is a cube with side one centimeter. Its volume is one times one times one. We represent it as 1 raised to the power 3, which is 1 cube. If you take more 1 cm cubes to form a cube, offside 2 cm, You will need 8 cubes. 8 can be expressed as 2 cube. Similarly, if you take cubes of side 1 cm to form a cube of side 3 cm, You will need 27 cubes. 27 can be expressed as 3 cube. The numbers 1, 8 and 27 are perfect cubes or cube numbers. They are called so because they equal the cube of a number. Now, look at cubes of some even numbers. Cube of 2 is 8. Cube of 4 is 64. Cube of 6 is 216. And it goes on. We can observe that the cube of an even number is even. Now look at the cubes of odd numbers. Cube of 1 is 1. Cube of 3 is 27. Cube of 5 is 125 and so on. Here, we observe that the cube of an odd number is odd. Now, let's look at an interesting pattern involving some of odd natural numbers. The first odd number is the cube of 1. The sum of next two consecutive odd numbers is 8 or cube of 2. The sum of next three consecutive odd numbers is 27 or cube of 3. The sum of next four consecutive odd numbers is 64 or cube of 4. 
and the pattern goes on. In this module you have learnt when a number is multiplied by itself three times the product obtained is called a perfect cube. The cube of an even number is always even. The cube of an odd number is always odd. Each prime factor of a number appears three times in the prime factorization of its cube.